welcome to the new episode of flash in today's session i am going to discuss about masking uh, so basically ma masking is to blending uh, the uh, two different object right so for applying the masking effect i am going to insert the background first of all so before to insert the background i'll just rename my layer for the background right and from the file menu i'll select import and select import to stage i'll select ready made image instead of this you can create your own background image for applying the uh, uh, masking effect to this image right uh, suppose i want to align the image right so to stage area is already selected so i want to make it exact apply the center alignment so vertically and horizontally i'll apply center alignment right and now it is center to the stage i'll insert another one layer let's say for inserting a shape instead of shape you can insert text as well and you can apply the masking effect not an issue right so mm, mm, let's create a star object right so for inserting the star uh, shape or to create the star shape you have to click on this drop down button of this rectangle tool right exactly you have to click on this drop down button so click on this button you will get a pop up box right the pop up menu uh, select the poly star tool so if you select the poly poly star tool and if you try to draw the shape right so you will get by default you will get a five corner angle poly star right okay and i don't want to add a polygon right but i want to insert a star shape so what i'm going to do i'll just open the property right i'll select the again shape and if you select the poly star tool you will get enable this option uh, button on the property panel so you have to open this dialog box and from the style option you have to select star right so let's say instead of five side if you want to insert if you want to create a seven side stars seven angle star you can say right so just change the number of sides and try to draw on the stage right that's it your star is ready with seven sides okay uh, remember the important point uh, for applying the masking effect the uh, the object which you are going to mask right it should be uh, filled with color if it is unfilled right you are not able to get the masking effect right so for this let's say i'm going to insert a keyframe up to the frame number 20 on both the layers right and i'll just press f6 to the shape layer on the keyframe number 10 right i'll change the position of the star i will apply create motion tween right so you can see on the background image on the background image i have applied a simple motion to this star object right now i am going to apply the masking effect so i want to mask this star shape right so i'll right select the layer i'll right click on it and select mask <coughs> so you can find Uh, on the timeline your timeline bar is automatically locked right and i'll press enter so through that object i mean the star object is masked so through the masked object you are able to uh, view the back side image the background image right 
let's see <coughs> the final show file right uh, don't worry you are able to uh, uh, unlock this layer and you are allowed to uh, change the position of this uh, you can say the object right not an issue so I'll change the position just to show you how to uh, unlock the layer and how to apply the different motion right to the same file right got it so that's it this is the masking okay suppose if you want to apply the <coughs> text uh, on this masking layer right so what I'm going to do I'll just remove this layer instead of star uh, with the same file I will insert a text right I'll write masking the color is too light I'll change the color make it blue right okay I'll uh, press F6 to the keyframe number 20 and keyframe number 10 I will change the position on different keyframes apply the motion you can apply a, a, a shape tweening as well right and then you can apply finally mast let's see the final output sorry you have to apply break apart to each and every keyframe right and instead of tween let's apply shape tween and see the output got it okay so instead of let's say masking you can able to now insert done On the keyframe number 10, I'll apply, sorry, uh, is control B, right? So for applying the <coughs> shape tweening. right I have use break apart option right and by pressing enter I have done this let's see the final output so you can find now masking with text winning as well thank you for watching my video we'll meet soon in the next session